Now that the sketch is complete, we can add the first feature. Extrude with a dimension of 38 millimeters. Next, we can add the eyes using an ellipse sketch on one of the side faces. Using move entities, we can modify its location. Once satisfied with your sketch, we can add an extruded cut feature. We will choose through all so that the eye can be seen on both sides. Now that we are done with the model, we can save it as an SCL file type and then load it into the MakerBot desktop software. It will print best if one of the side faces is on the ground. Here is the final product. You can always go back and make design changes such as changing the size or creating an opening for a cell phone charger. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed.